Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new here. My name is Bronte, and today I have a ton of cleaning motivation for you. We are going to be cleaning up this messy house, tackling all sorts of things around the house, and I'm hoping to give you a ton of cleaning motivation so that you can tackle some of the stuff around your own home. I would love for you to stick around and subscribe if this is your first time here for tons of cleaning motivation every single week, as well as DIY home renovation and makeover videos. I have a ton of those on my channel as well. But in today's video, we are gonna tackle all of these messes. My house is a disaster right now because we are in the middle of laying flooring, as you can see, and we've made a ton of progress. So if you saw my last video, then you saw that the kitchen was not as completed as it is right now but in the middle of doing all this flooring stuff the house has just gotten away from me so we are going to tackle all of it today we are going to clean up downstairs we are going to clean upstairs as well and i hope that you guys enjoy this video give it a thumbs up if you are in need of some cleaning motivation and today we are going to start off in the living room tackling all of this laundry picking up the toys and just tidying up whatever we can even though we're still working on the flooring and the house is not going to be spotless and super cleaned up. celebrated my daughter's third birthday and we just celebrated Easter so there's a bunch of toys and random stuff all over the place that does not necessarily belong downstairs so I'm just going to pick up what I can before moving on to vacuuming up the floors getting them as clean as possible I've been trying to keep the house clean or as clean as I can while we are going through this whole process of laying the flooring in our house and redoing it all of our all ourselves 
And it has been a task and a half, let me tell you. We've been going in and out of the garage a ton, going in and outside with the dogs and everything. So the floors have been getting super dirty and obviously not having flooring on half of the floors in our living room and downstairs has also made everything super dirty. So I've been having to vacuum a ton lately and my Shark Rocket vacuum has been holding up so well and getting the job done. Has been working so nicely on our new floors. These are Pergo laminate floors and we have had no issues with using this vacuum on there it works great on the hard floors and it also works great on the carpet which we are also going to vacuum up today once we work our way upstairs because that is a hot mess from everybody coming in and out of the house the garage sawdust from cutting the wood flooring and all of that fun stuff One step forward and another back I will never try to fool ya I'm one heartbeat away from going mad Girl, when you look like that Closer, closer I'ma get closer to you, yeah Got me, baby Got me hooked on you once again Another chance, loving you is all I wanted. I'm wide open for a love affair, girl. When you look like that, closer, closer, I'ma get closer to you. Yeah, got me, baby, got me hooked on you once again. Damn, girl, I need you. How many times? We are going to move on to tackling the kitchen area now and getting that all cleaned up because there's a ton of dishes that have been sitting in the sink for way too long and longer than I care to admit because honestly I don't even know how long they had been sitting there. Dishes on the stovetop, stuff on the counters that needs to be wiped down and put away so we are going to take care of all of that today. I'm also going to be able to show you a little bit more of our flooring as I'm cleaning up the appliances and wiping everything down. If you are new around here or if this is your first time coming across my channel then you do not know that up until a couple of weeks ago, we had uh, two different kinds of flooring in our downstairs throughout the whole downstairs. Actually, three because the laundry room has an even different one. But we have been in the process of replacing all of the flooring downstairs to kind of give it a one seamless look and brighten the space up because we had very, very dark floors in our living room area, which just showed every single speck of dirt, dust, and everything. Dark floors are very hard to to keep looking clean with two kids and two dogs, let me tell ya. And then in the kitchen, we had this vinyl linoleum type of stuff that looked like stone, but it wasn't. So we wanted to get update the look of our home by replacing the floors, and that is the project, the DIY project that we are currently working on, which will be a huge makeover video once we are all finished. But we are going to tackle these dishes, get those all taken care of before moving on to wiping everything down, wiping down the appliances, and just getting all the grime off of everything. Random question, if you have ever used that power wash by Dawn, the power wash dish soap that you're supposed to spray it on and then it just soaks for a few minutes and then you just basically rinse the dish off and everything comes off super easily, do you like it or not? I can't decide if I like it or not because every time that I have used it, I have still had to really scrub the pan. And I feel like the scent is kind of overpowering for my liking, but let me know down below in the comments. If you have tried it, do you like it? And how long do you usually have to let your stuff sit? I know on the bottle it says a few minutes, but I feel like a few minutes wasn't long enough. And all I was trying to get out was some cheese in the pan.
wiping my counters down with some Thieves Cleaner by Young Living. You guys know I love this stuff because it smells amazing and it's low toxic. Even though I was just using Dawn Power Wash Dish Soap Balance. It's all about balance here. But I'm going to refill my cleaning bottle with some more Thieves and then we are going to get back to cleaning. This stuff works great on everything, honestly. It works great on my counters. It works great on my appliances. There's nothing that it can't clean. I love this stuff and I just use a microfiber cloth to wipe everything down and it gets the job done. Like a light, lighting up in the dark You make it right, I forgot how to act It's so plastic Every time you make me nervous and I lose my words It's been a while since I forgot the most simple words Now that everything is wiped down in here, we've swept all the crumbs onto the floor from the countertops. I'm going to wipe or er, vacuum everything up in here using my Shark Rocket vacuum and just get everything all nice and cleaned up. What do you guys think of the floors? If you have been around for a while, we're obviously not done. We still have to do baseboards and all of that stuff throughout the house. But what do you guys think? I feel like it has brightened up the space and updated it so much and I am obsessed with the floors. Let's make our way upstairs. We are going to vacuum up the stairs. Who doesn't love walking on freshly vacuumed fluffy stairs? They desperately need it. Like I had mentioned earlier, we've been in and out of the garage so much and there's sawdust in the garage from cutting the flooring pieces and all of that stuff. So I'm going to vacuum up the stairs. I've been vacuuming them religiously. I have been vacuuming so much. Luckily, I love vacuuming. It is so soothing to me. So I have been enjoying doing it. But we are going to straighten up the loft. I have a bunch of laundry that I brought up here that I hadn't gotten around to putting away. Blankets and all sorts of stuff that need to be put away from when my dad had visited and I had washed them and I just honestly never got around to putting them away. It's been a really hectic over here. But we are going to fold all this stuff up. We're going to put stuff away. And we are also going to clean my daughter's bedroom because that is a hot mess as well. Her room is such a disaster. I've mentioned this a few times before. She's been in this weird phase of life because she's just recently turned three where some days she naps and then some days she doesn't. And even though she still needs a nap because she gets super cranky or overtired, she won't nap and she likes to destroy her room <laughs> instead of napping, which is always fun, but it makes for good cleaning motivation. So after we straighten all of this up, we are going to clean up her room too because it's a hot mess. It's a complete disaster. It, it's, it's a lot. We did not get around to cleaning my son's room in this video because honestly, I just ran out of time and I had to get started on dinner. My husband started working on flooring when he got home from work. So in the next video, we will tackle my almost six year old son's room as well as cleaning up the bathrooms and getting those taken care of too.
I wasn't joking when I said her room is a hot mess disaster. We are going to straighten this all up today. We are not going to get super into deep cleaning, but we are going to get everything picked up and cleaned up. I'm going to remove the rug from her room because I do need to wash it. It's been a while since I've done that, but we are going to take care of straightening everything up, tidying it up, organizing it a little better, and picking up all of the things off of the floor so I can get in here with a vacuum and clean it all up nice and get it all ready for my little girl to be able to go to bed in it at night without stuff all over the place. So I have my little helpers here. I have my dogs here making sure that I'm getting everything done properly and we are just going to tackle this bedroom and get it cleaned up. I hope that today's video has given you a ton of cleaning motivation to tackle some messes around your own home. Thank you so much for being here and for watching this video. It means the world to me to have you all here spending time out of your day with me. So thank you so much. If this is your first time here, I would love for you to stick around and subscribe for more cleaning motivation every week. 
Thank you guys again for watching. I will catch you in the next video. If you need some more cleaning motivation, be sure to click on one of the videos that I have linked up here on the screen or click on the videos down below in my description box if you have not seen any of my makeovers yet. Thank you guys again. Have a super amazing day. Stay safe and stay well and take care.